The good news about malaria is that we have the tools to prevent it, led by the long-term insecticide-treated mosquito net, which has two functions. As many of you know, the Anopheles mosquito uh, only bites after 10 o'clock at night generally and is most voracious around 3 o'clock in the morning, so all children should be in bed by then. And the long-lasting bed net can cover two children, uh, maybe three. And it, the twofold purpose or benefits are that uh, it protects those sleeping under the net from getting bitten, and when the mosquito lands on the net, she dies because of the insecticide. And that disrupts the Darwinian reproductive cycle. So we've had uh, instances where we've covered entire villages with bed nets, but not the surrounding villages. But after a year, the surrounding villages noted a significant decrease in the incidence of malaria. Now the challenge is where the rubber meets the road. And that's organizing, scheduling, implementing, coordinating, getting these tools out to all the people, and then they're utilizing the tools. We know the faith-based institutions are the most trusted in the villages of Africa. So how do we bring the might and power, the clout, the sincere interest of all the members of CIFA together? I don't think it's going to get done without the collaborative and comprehensive engagement of the faith community. And you know, this is such a unique opportunity. I've never seen an opportunity in my lifetime whereby working together we could uh, eliminate deaths from such a devastating disease. And we, we can't eradicate it that that will need a vaccine which could be 15 to 20 years away. But by coming together, we could uh, see the day in the next seven years where children are no longer absent from school, where workers are no longer absent from their jobs, where hospital beds are freed up to take care of other diseases. And I think if we work together and hard and with, with, with faith and with creative thinking, we could see the day where there will be no more deaths from malaria.